Well, I think partially that these books a decade ago would, or longer, they would have been classified not as young adult novels, but coming of age novels. So I think there's a misconception about YA that that because they are stories about young people that they're young stories, and some are. Some are like, I want to be a cheerleader and how I'm going to do it. And those are great and they have an audience. But there's also, I think, the ones that are finding resonance on those larger scales. It's, it's not just with teenagers, it's with adults too. That's why you're seeing you know them break through in bigger numbers. And I think it is because they are about these things that are universal. You know, you're not writing about sort of juvenile issues, you're writing about sort of love and life and mortality and, and grieving and forgiveness. Um, you know, for me, it's the young people just make a, an interesting vehicle to tell the stories and I've sort of thought about various reasons why that might be, but I just am drawn to telling the stories through people. The stories that are on my mind now as someone my age, but more often than not, it's these sort of 18 to 22 year olds that tell the tale.